everyone, I'm here to do my first video. I've decided to pursue making regular videos. My idea is to do all my videos based on fashion, art, and books. And the acronym for that is FAB, so F.A.B will be what my videos will be about. Every week will be probably something different in between those categories. Today is going to be a back to school haul. I know some of you have already been back to school, I haven't. Hopefully this helps you in the future. A little bit about myself, my name is Camilla, I'm going into grade 10. I also love to write and when I'm older I hope to be a graphic designer or even a writer. I read a ton and as you know, love fashion maybe a little bit too much. And I love art, I'm going to show you some of my art maybe in the next video so if you have any ideas actually just let me know. Okay so I'm going to get started on my haul. I got this summer for school so it's a lot but you know, I've worn some of it during the summer and some of it's going to be for the fall. This top I got at All Saints. I think it's really fun because it has all these drawings on it. There's skulls and actually there's a vampire on the back. There's all these monsters and stuff. I love tops like these because it really shows my artistic personality. It's kind of weird. It may look weird but it has a droopy neck and you can also tie it to do it different ways. This is a cashmere sweater. Yes, it's 100% cashmere. It's from Aritzia. Not as fun as the last top, but it's super soft, and I love how long it is so I can pair it with leggings. Okay, I love this next top. I got it at a little boutique in New York called Scoop. color is so bold and bright, which I love. Uh, it's great for summer, but I like a pop of color in fall, so I really like this. It's flowy and it's pretty. I've never seen a color of the top like this. It's really bright turquoise. So the first two tops I showed you were from New York. I just came back a couple days ago. Um, I also got this there. I was really drawn to it because I, I draw a lot of this stuff, so when I see it on t-shirts, I love it. Okay, so if you see my video response, and you've already seen this top, but I did get it this summer, and it was a great top to wear during the summer because the colors are so pretty. And I'm Forever 21, and it's great for I'm going to wear it in the fall, too, with black leggings. Why not? But yeah, these are some of my favorite colors. This top's from Zara's. It was on sale. I wore it with shorts this summer, and it was really cute because tucked in, it kind of comes out and it's really pretty. So next top is pink. Very pink. Um, there's like a, some sort of flag on it. I'm not really sure if it's the US flag which is some sort of print. It's pretty. It's silk I believe. Sure. Let's go with that. It's William Rass. I got it online. Next top is from H&M. It's, kind of, really, it's not really a dress. It's just a long top I'd wear with leggings. It has a really cool sequin pattern. And I really like pastel pink. I got a basic sweater as well for fall. It has um, ruched sleeves. Really pretty. It goes with anything over a dress, over a long top. I got another t-shirt with a face on it. It's what I love, seriously. But um, this is really cool. You can't buy this where I live, so I got it online. The brand is Harajuku. Hara Harajuku lovers. And they do a series of t-shirts and clothing with a uh, kind of anime, anime stuff on it. So there you go. Hope you can see that clearly. The back has the brand and a really bright pop of color. So I wore this in my video response and it's the same uh, designer as the last top I just showed you. So again, more faces on it. It's really what I love. Since I love drawing these things, I like to show it through my clothing. Again, Harajuku Lovers. It's slouchy up top and it has this, like a high collar. See how it goes straight like that? Yeah, I was right. So Justin Timberlake does make this line. Um, mostly for men's jeans, but they also, online, they sell the tops as well. So this is another one by him. It's great because I love the skulls down the side. It's flowy. It's a great material. Not too short, but not too long. Next I have, it's more of a girly top, but I like it with an edgy skirt, like a black ruffled skirt or something. It's just a pretty um, uh, scoop neck top. It has a great neckline detail. So would have to wear a necklace with this one. It's really pretty. The shoulders give it a girly flare, but the beading gives it a really edgy detail. So this is by language, but I did get it online. This is such a pretty dress. It's um, from H&M. It has a kind of cream and a darker beige line pattern. It's really loose and slouchy on top, but then it uh, fits around the bottom. This is a more casual dress. It's a light jean. Uh, two colors of jean, and it looks a little big, but once you tie it around, you cinch it around the waist and tie it, it's really flattered. This is really pretty. From Forever 21. I love that store so much, like who doesn't, but got some pockets. This is a really cool cardigan slash vest. 
It has beading all down the sides like this, and it has it on the shoulders. So there's a little bit of padding underneath, so it gives you a little bit of height on the shoulders, but it's really cool to like pair with a simple black dress. This one is from Billabong, we got it in New York. It's kind of like a form fitting a little bit, but not too tight. Cool print on it. It has like little like uh, a little spotting detail and roses kind of mixed in with it. It's strapless, but I plan on wearing like a t-shirt underneath. Okay, so the next one is a vest from H&M. It's because it's light beige. It's got some ruffles down the side. It's a really great accessory to any outfit, like a plain skirt and a plain tank top. It really makes anything look pretty dressed up, so I really like this. This is a bl plain black top, but it has the accessories on the sleeve. It's really pretty. It's slouchy, and it's really it looks really wide, actually, when you look at it, but when it's tucked into a skirt, it looks really pretty. This dress probably looks purple on the camera, but it's actually like a... It's more blue than purple. It's really pretty. It's, it's not as fitting as it was when I first got it. It stretched out a little bit, but it has a great line detail going across. This is a romper from Club Monaco. It probably looks really large, but because silk is so clingy, you kind of want a bigger size to flatter you. When you tie it around the waist, you can see how it accentuates your waist. Okay, so this is a little bit more plain, but these are good pieces because they're so versatile. But This is just a plain black dress from uh, Joe Fresh. It can be worn as a skirt if you kind of um, fold it, and it can be worn as a dress. I saved the best for last. I just got this today. Um, I went to New York, and there was like a little shop in our hotel, but they didn't have any of my size left, so we actually ordered it, and it came today in the mail. It's such a cool skirt. Detailing goes around from the front to the back. It has a zipper going all the way down. It's so pretty. I've never seen anything like it. If you watch my video response, and you've already seen this, but again, I, it's from H&M. Really pretty, great fall colors. Uh, there's so many different striping and there's kind of gold thread. You probably can't see it, but there's gold thread that goes down. Okay, so this is my favorite color, cobalt blue. It's a little short. It's from uh, February 21. Definitely going to wear this with leggings. But yeah, really pretty. I've never seen a, cur a skirt with this intense color. It's hard to find this color, especially in the fall, even in the winter. I just can hardly find this color. It's kind of rare. Okay, so this is from Aritzia. The color's super pretty. It's like a bright purple. Uh, again, it's like a band skirt. It has a zipper in the back. Uh, it's like a band skirt from BCBG. Got these in New York. They are so awesome! They have a really awesome uh, detailing on the side. It's like metallic studs. And they're kind of worn out in the front to give that cool effect. They have like a spotting detail around the front. They are by Sam Elderman. Yeah, very cool. Opposite side, but they don't have it on this side either. So these are from Forever 21. Really cool. They kind of look like cowboy boots. The edgy setting kind of gives it a different look. But I think they're suede. A little bit of a heel. Really cute with black leggings. Aldos. And they have a really cool layering pattern around the ankle and a little buckle. Really smooth. They don't have any heel. I love a boot with no heel. Okay, well, thank you for watching. That was my back to school haul. That was just my fashion part. I'll do different things with fashion. Uh, outfits of the week, outfit of the day, putting an outfit together, hauls, and all that stuff. I can't wait to get started on fashion, but if you're not a big fan of fashion, I also am going to do books and art. I'm really excited to do those too because I'm obsessed with reading and buying books. It'll be great to show you guys my plan to read shelf and, you know, hauls from chapters. So Leave in the comments what you'd like to see from my videos, what would be helpful or what would be good to see. So, thank you for watching. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs>